this is the death of Mario. It's a creepy Mario 64 game where you actually die and have to explore the underworld of the Mario universe. And the only way to regain your life is to find the one one-up mushroom down here. So let's see if we can find it. Welcome back to 8-Bit Brad's Month of Horror. There are just two more creepy videos left in this month of October, so you're not gonna wanna miss today's video and subscribe now so you don't miss the grand finale tomorrow. But for now, this is the death of Mario. Okay, and then it literally just drops you here. This looks like where it's starting. And as you just saw, this was called the death of Mario, so let's see what happens to this guy. All right, Toad. Please explain this to me. What's going on? And your mouth is looking kind of creepy. Hey, Mario, it's the day before Halloween. That's also why I'm playing this one. I'm so excited that I'm already in costume. You are. What's my costume? Why boggers, dude? Boggers? What? Also, Princess Peach is throwing a Halloween Eve party at her castle. She's expecting you to be there soon. You better get going. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty well all I know about this. The title and the fact that it takes place before Halloween. So what a fitting event because if you're watching this video the day i posted it it is the day before halloween right isn't that perfect oh what do we got here we got some roses they're not these look like piles of blood or something not roses maybe it is maybe i don't know it's up to interpretation i guess but yeah let's see uh let's see what happens so far it looks like a pretty basic kind of platforming stage but you know the way these things go they always start normal and turn really messed up and creepy so oh Okay, so yeah, you got the, the creepiness of later the, to look forward to, right? Um, is this water toxic or something? I'm gonna go no? Okay, I guess not. That's why I saw those coins in there. I'm like, come on, you can't be trolling me like that this early on. Or if it is, then it's a really mean type of horror game. Uh, Mr. Sign, what do you got? Oh, we just got a void, okay. Warning, the bridge to Toad Town is collapsed. Do not jump down. I mean, you can't tell me to not do something like that, right? And expect me to listen. Oh, did I actually just die? Oh, oh, wait, that's how Mario dies. I just got the title. This is the death of Mario because you kill yourself on the bridge. So are we dead? Hey, bomb. Hello, welcome to the, wait a minute. Can it be Mario, the Mario? I cannot believe it. I am meeting the Mario. While I did not think we would meet like this. You see, this is the land of the dead, the underwear. <laughs> oh, it's like Paper Mario, they have that name. The only way someone can end up here is to my knowledge is by dying, yeah. I'm sorry to break this to you, but you are dead. <laughs> I would say enjoy your time here, but you will not. This is a place of, <laughs> yeah, literally. Feel free to stay here at Da Dom Town for as long as you like. We do not get much company. Okay, so we're dead. All right, cool. So I like the atmosphere down here. We got some creepy trees, a bunch of bob bombs, really dark and gloomy. Toad hat, yes. Oh, what is that? What is that? Dead Harry Potter. <laughs> what? Ghost trick? Okay, interesting. All right, what do you got, bomb? Can you talk to me? This is the statue of Dudom. Or Dudom. Dudom. It looks kind of bad, but it's the best thing we got. This is the one thing we look up to every day, hoping that one day we may move on to a better life. Alright, so this is a pretty depressing town. What happens when we go up here? Is there anything on the roofs? Nope. Just uh, roofs. Ooh, there's like little caves there. Um, what about the buildings? Can we go inside here? Uh, doesn't look like it. What does this bomb got? Hey, bomb. A Dadom has told me to take down these posters. I think he's full of baloney. Why can't I have posters up of what I like? I know, huh? It's just a bomb. He's dead. You know, he's got to do something in his uh, afterlife, I guess. Okay, I'm kind of glitching on this statue. And this is the last bomb. What do you got? I see this dude's posters everywhere and I'm mad. <laughs> I cannot go and see any of these things on them. How did he even get these posters anyway? Okay. So even though they're all dead, at least they still got their sense of humor. It doesn't look like I can go in this thing. So I guess we go into this creepy looking cave thing. Splendid. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I was confused. Okay. This just got kind of cool. This just got cool. What do you got? It's like, stop bumping in everything. You have met with a terrible fate. Have you not? Oh, that sounded similarly close to the Majora's Mask. Happy Mask Salesman guy. There's no need to worry. I will help you get back to life. The name is Sunny? Siny? 
Signy the sign. Oh, okay. Yeah, makes sense. I've been down here for a while. I know my stuff. To get out of here, you will need a one-up mushroom. There is only one left that is known to exist. You must get it before sunrise. Your first task is to get across the poisonous woods. On the other side, there is a way underground. You must get there. We will meet again soon. Farewell and good luck. Yo, we got a sign as a companion? All right. So the goal of this is to get back alive. That's cool. Uh, let's get in the pipe. All right. Sounds good. Guys, what do you think? Can we do it? You think we're going to resurrect Mario back to life? Look at these Goombas. Okay. Hey, Goomba. Smack. Yo, they're like really cool looking. They're like ghostly Goombas. I don't know what it is. Oh, man. these Are these just like normal Goombas though with the skin? Yeah, looks like it. Looks like it. Okay. So we just kill these Goombas. Are they like double dead? How do you die in the underworld? If you, are you, yeah, are you like double dead? Are you like double D? Um, okay, so we got more ghosts. Okay, 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 I can't be, yeah, I can't be double dead. I cannot be doing this stuff. All right, and we are back up. There you go. All right, so this seems like an interesting adventure we're about to go on. So subscribe if you think we can uh, resurrect Mario back to life later in this game. But for now, this is Purple Goop. Here is poison. Touching it will give you a sinking feeling. Oh, okay, so in the uh, overworld, the purple stuff was friendly. Now in the uh, underworld, it kills you. So it's cool. I guess all the enemies here are the underworld variants. Uh, very interesting. We have one. So, okay, okay. L let me get my head around this concept here. We, we got to get a one-up, typical Mario attire, but this is probably like the most important one-up of Mario's career because he's on zero lives. He's literally dead. And to guide us through the underworld of the Mushroom Kingdom, we have a sign. Signy the sign to be exact. What uh, What's happening? I, I can't see and I slipped down. And I fell in a spider pit. Oh, and your health meter's all gross like that. I mean, I saw it before, but I guess, yeah, it makes sense. It would come up when you get hit. Oh, I can barely even jump on this spider web. That's cool. Uh, but I am getting out of here. Let's just keep going. So we got here. We got the coins. Okay, where are we supposed to go? Okay, here. Never mind. I don't know. Uh, the one direction I didn't look was the direction of the platforms. Okay, we got more goosely Goombas. Not letting those guys slow me down. Whoop, whoop, whoop. No, I didn't mean to click the camera button. Camera, stop that. Okay, okay. We got up here. Is this a checkpoint? What is this? I guess so. It seems like it. What else would it be? Okay, sign. Tell me more about what's going on. This here is a checkpoint. Touching it will make you respond at it. Okay. So you can't, so you can double die is what this guy is saying. Uh, but you can checkpoint. You can get checkpoints. Uh, anyways, we kill the fly guys and go on these purple looking soap bars or these purple tiger camouflage things. I don't know. We're making jumps. We're making leaps of faith here. Was this called the underwear? I think it was. I, I kind of already forget. I was like half paying attention when I read things in general. Uh, all I know is there was like that Happy Mask Salesman kind of reference thing. That sounded eerily similar to him. But so far, all I can say is there is a lot of dead spiders in the Mushroom Kingdom. We're in like spider world here. Uh, can we, yeah, and there, we always get stuck in their web, which is an interesting feature. Doesn't really play a factor in the gameplay so far. Okay, hold up. Oh, we got to pay attention here. This is, this is a steep drop if we fall. And these are some rickety rackety stilts, uh, but we good. We good. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, is this it? Is this the first level done? Let's go. Let's go through this thing. Whatever it is. Oh, it's signing the sign. What's good? We did it. You have made it. Well done. Do not start celebrating though. <laughs> Me? I wasn't celebrating. You have only just begun. Your next task is to get through the sewers. You will find that there is unbreathable air down there. Be careful. Oh. After you make it through, you will get to the tower where the one-up is held. Let's go. I will explain more to you there. We will meet again soon. Farewell and good luck. Okay. Man, this game is framed like a whole RPG adventure game. And it's a pretty cool concept. I mean, obviously Nintendo wouldn't do a concept like this with Mario dying and stuff. But yeah, I kind of like it how you explore the, the underworld. Actually, no, they kind of did in Paper Mario, Super Paper Mario. You literally went to the underwear there. <laughs> the underwear there. Yeah, trust me. People who play the game know what I'm talking about. But, um, yeah, anyways. Oh, we get on-off uh, bricks. That's what this is. Okay. Okay, so it's simple. Easy does it. And then, okay, we turn this on and those turn on? Are these timed? No, they're not timed. At least I don't think. There's no timer noise. Okay. All right, and now we can go through the pipe to the next level of the underwear. I cannot see. Oh, so we got shy guys down there. Or those aren't shy guys. Those are those other guys. Uh, we got fireball guys. And we got shy guy guys. Oh, that's the poison. I see what we got to do. All right, down the poison we go. Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Your health is going to be limited. But we can just kill these uh, gas mask kind of shy guy guys. Oh, but your health gets drained fast. 
Um, we kill the... Yeah, because then we can kill them, get the coins, refill our health. Um, uh, it's not too hard. Do we... Okay, we don't re regenerate life when we get out of it, but we can collect this little heart. Uh, we got to find... Okay, what's our goal here? I don't know. I can't see the switch. Okay, but I assume we got to go here. Okay. And where's the switch? Where's the switch? It's got to be this way. I don't know. I'm... I'm just making a leap of faith, a run of faith, rather. Oh, you really don't have any time. Okay, no, we got all these coins. No need to panic. The switch should be here, because I don't know where else it would be. Um, all right, I guess there's more to this. Never mind. What do we got here? It's got to be, yeah, it's right there. Okay, the switch is here. So we flip you, and then what? What's down here? Is there anything down here? Why is it just... Oh, I guess... Okay, this is where you fall. So, then the only way to go is here, so... Easy, <laughs> easy does it. I know what this bottom platform is for now. Okay, easy does it just like that. Now we flip the bricks again and we go up here. And does this lead us back to where we were before? I think so, right? No. Yeah, okay, this is where we were before. So I don't want that guy shooting me. Hold up. Yeah, but okay, it's still flipped the same way. What? Oh no, that thing's, that thing's open. Never mind. Okay, so all we got to do is go down here. Whatever, take this uh, this little poison damage. Whatever it is. Easy does it. This is now open, which wasn't before. Hey, hang on. Does this heart work? Why is this not working? There we go. So we go through here, and this is a new area. Oh, and a checkpoint. Yo, let's go. Okay. All right, and the journey continues. Signy the sign. Let's go. Where are you? Help me get my one-up. Bring me back to life. Uh, we go here. Okay, nothing doing. We just got some coins. Oh, I guess this is a little, a little rest stop. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not just going to ask questions. I'm just going to keep going. We got some more electric shocking dudes. Come on, shocking McShockingsons. Get out of my way. I got coins to collect. I got life to live. You're just a shocker. I'm an Italian plumber. No, I got hit by the fire. No, Mr. Fire Guy. Okay, we're good. We're good. We just got to get this heart. Come on. Me and my life. And now, where did we come from again? We came from that way. So we got to go this way over there this wall for the fire okay making good progress i can't see down wait i'm taking damage i'm in the smoke okay i gotta stop screwing around um that, that looks like a dead end so here looks like the way to go oh oh my god i'm gonna die no 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 i'm actually gonna no oh, that you do not have time to screw around at all and you start all the way here oh man oh we had this checkpoint oh, okay we're good here, I'm gonna waste no time. We're just gonna go here and go right down. I didn't even realize before I was getting hurt. And then we got this big old jump you gotta climb on. And yeah, okay. Now that we know we have to move quickly in that spot, it wasn't too bad. Uh, but still, they don't give you uh, much time at all. So nope, nope, I don't think, oh, I did make it. I was like, I missed time that long jump in that I almost missed time. What, no! I glitched again! I always find a way to break these! Every time and I'm stuck in the wall! Oh my god. Every time and I... Could someone make a compilation every time I've just glitched or broken one of these things? I always get stuck in the geometry. Alright, I'll, I'll be right back. Oh, I didn't get all my health, but whatever. No, oh, whatever. Okay, we're good. We're good. It's, it's just as easy as that. Oh, we got a Mr. Eye, but he's a red eye. Well, wow, just making his eye red makes him that much more creepier. Uh, so what is this box? Okay, we push the box. Uh, what do we do? Can we kill these little um, little balls? Nope, we can't. Okay. Oh, they just go right through it. What is this? Um. Oh, does this does this eye like instantly kill you? Is that why we need this? Stupid, this guy can shoot right through the box. Now I'm wondering. Okay, if you stand in the, this eyeball's sight, what happens? I don't know what that box is for. I don't I, Oh, I think you need the box for... Yeah, you need it for up there. Or do you? Or do you? That's what a simple mind would think. But me, I I might need it. All right, so we're going to push this box. <laughs> the really janky way. It's fine. It's fine. Oh! Yeah, you just got to avoid the fire. This might be very slow and tedious. But hey, we going to do it, son. Go, 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 run, run, jab, jab, smack your face against the wall because you're not really pushing it. Oh, that's easy. You kind of just avoid the fire by doing that. Go, go, go. No, I messed up. I actually messed up because now I can't push him. Oh, fire everywhere. Fire everywhere. Oh, mm, and I was trying to squeeze through, but I couldn't. Nope, nope. 
Oh, my two health points. My two health points. Please, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Okay. Gotta do this smart. Okay, bottom fire. Shoot. There you go. Push, push, mush, 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 mush. Go. Get up. Okay, good. I think we're good now. No, we're not. Backflip. Yes. Okay. We made it. Is this the pipe? No, it's not. It's a red brick. Okay. Sure. Why not? Um, okay, so we got a blue thing here. We flip that and then... Okay, so we do go. This is the next area. Oh, no. It's a cannon. It's a cannon. There's cannons here. What? Where do we go? Where, uh, I can't see. Um, I guess we just go up. Oh, nope. What? Am I supposed to go somewhere? Is that a, that's just a roof. Where am I supposed to go in this cannon? Do I gotta go here? Oh, I do not want to fire over there and kill myself. Oh, you gotta go directly up. Oh, okay. I'm glad I didn't launch myself across the stage. Anyways, it's signy the sign. I gotta stop bonking these signs. What do you got? You have come very far. There is only one last task for you to overcome. You must get to the top of the tower. To get up, you must platform your way over a bottomless pit. I believe you have done many things like this before, so I think you will be fine. I think, thanks. You must be quick, though. It's almost sunrise. Oh, shoot. Get up and get the mushroom. We will meet again soon. Farewell and good luck. Okay, thank you, signing the sign. Let's do this. Into the pipe we go. Okay, here we go. This is like the last Bowser level. Oh, this atmosphere is so cool. And yeah, look at the background. It's literally almost sunrise. Oh, there's fire. Fire, we don't got time for this. It's almost sunrise. Oh, this stuff's like slowing me down, I think. Why is there a giant hole in the middle of the thing? Okay. Okay, sure. Um, This is... Oh, this is just like a Bowser's level. But this is really cool. I like the atmosphere so much in this game. So we got um, we got more bombs. We got we got more platforms that's sliding in and out. Okay. Easy does it. Oh, this is intense. This is a lot more harder than a Bowser stage. We got another one with a fire bar and a fireball. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Now we got the, the uh, Ferris wheel. All right, get on the wheel. Get off the wheel and continue on. Man, this is a high tower, but we are making good progress on this. Um, yes, thank you, fire bar. Goodbye, fire bar. Ooh, this looks tricky. Actually, not really. As long as these bars like can't fling you off, I think it should be good. How do we get up there? Oh, we got a wall jump. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let me align this. Jump. Wall jump. Yep. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. I can't see. I can't see because of the camera. Um, this, this is another one you're gonna have to align up. Ready? One, two. Yes, okay. Okay, making good progress here. Now, what's with these platforms? Do I go through them? Okay. They're just really grady! Whoa, 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 whoa! That fire started at the worst time. I was saying it's very great-like. Grady, if you will. Um, alright, so note. Those giant things will spray fire at the worst time? Like that. How does it know when I'm gonna jump? Don't, no, no, no. Don't tell me it's on a timer. I just happen to time it. No. Okay. <sighs> okay, back on this one. I swear the fire always shoots right when you jump, or maybe right when you're about to land. So go here. There we go. That's how it's done. And now we're on this massive staircase. What looks like? No. What? I hit the wall. There's an invisible wall there. Oh. You... Where am I? Okay, back by the stairs. You know what? I'm just going to stay in the middle of the stairs because the left side gets sketch with Mario 64 physics. But it doesn't really matter. Looks like we're coming up in the end. And it's King bub -omb. Of course he's the final boss. Ah, Mario, I've been expecting you. I have heard from the others in Dudom Town that you have died. Mm-hmm. After hearing that, I knew you'd come up here to find the one-up mushroom, the last one known to exist. I knew that this was my only chance to get revenge on you for, you know, killing me. Oh, that's right. We did in Mario 64. So I went off to get the mushroom before you so that I could be brought back to life instead of you. But now actually succeeding at my plan, I will realize that I can do better. I can win a battle against you. Then afterwards, I will be alive again, and you will be down here in the underwear forever. The perfect revenge. So let us battle and see who really is the better royal battler. Uh, so is it just the King bob boss fight? All that talk, and I'm just gonna jump behind him and grab his butt and throw him. Is this? Do they spice it up, or is this just like King bob Uh Let us... Only one way to find out, right? Okay. Uh, nope, it just looks like a King Bob-omb fight. <laughs> okay, well, there you have it. 
Wow, what? Can it be that a pipsqueak like you is killing me again? Yeah, I mean, it's pretty easy. I can't believe it. I thought for sure that you would win. I would win this time. You are just the better man, I guess. Here, take your one up and enjoy your life. I wish I could still enjoy mine. I'm fading away. Oh, that's a weird looking one up. I guess that's why they weren't 3D in Mario 64. Oh, but it's the star model. I see what they're doing. Okay, so let's get the one up. And are we alive? Do we do it? Oh, why are we still on this creepy sign? Is this guy scamming me? Was this all a trick? I should be alive. Congratulations, Mario, on getting that one up. You did a very nice job. However, there is something I need to tell you. Uh oh, that mushroom is useless. I knew it was a trick. You see, you never died. Yep, you have been alive this entire time. For you to understand what happened tonight, I need to tell you a story. Oh boy, here we go. This guy yaps. One year ago, I was killed as a ghost wandering the living world. I was sent to the underwear, not knowing what to do, but I wanted revenge on the one who killed me. The only way for me to get that revenge was for me to get a one-up mushroom and return to the living world. However, as you know, there was only one mushroom left. I knew I could not get it. I was just not strong enough. However, I knew you could get it. So tonight, I sent you down here. I disguised as a sign and gave you directions where the last one-up mushroom was located. I wanted you to get me that mushroom before tomorrow so I can get my revenge. What? As you can see, my plan worked. You got it. And now that you got it, I can now get my revenge and you can get to that party? However, before you go, I should probably tell you who I am. My name is obviously not Signy. That would easily be in my top 10 worst baby names list. <laughs> my actual name is Nathaniel. Nathaniel Bandy? What? <laughs> Nathaniel Bandy? Well, anyways, goodbye, Mario. Have fun at that party. I have business to take care of. Nathaniel Bandy. We were helping this whole time. What did you know? Was this is this game made for something related to him or his channel? I'm actually curious. And that seems like a random name to just call him, but okay, why not? I guess we take it. They don't mention it, Nathaniel. We'll help you get alive. And we did it! That was a weird ending. That was a confusing ending, so we weren't dead the whole time. We weren't dead the whole time. We were just Somehow in the underwear, but we were tricked by a sign who was really Nathaniel Bandy. Okay, well, I guess we're in the Halloween party now, so like all good things, right? But for now, I hope you enjoyed this little game. As is, it was really fun. So make sure you tune in tomorrow to join me for the grand finale of 8-Bit Brad's Month of Horror.